All right, let's talk about some more Dragon Fable. Now, before we start, I just want to say I don't have time to record a second video for today because I just wasted a lot of time with my video on the main channel, but, you know, that's how it works. Um, Yeah, I don't have time, but as a little payback, I'm going to do uh, two videos, no, three, tomorrow. So, yeah, uh, I was going to do a PvP with viewers video because... A couple more people gave me their IDs, which is awesome. Well, a couple more of you gave me your IDs, which is much appreciated. So, yeah, I'm going to um, do three tomorrow. So, yeah, I'm going to watch this making plants cutscene first. Because it's, well, I assume it's the start of the war. Pella Village. Whee! <laughs> It's the gate. And it's me. And it's Tomix. That sneaky little... That wad of greed. Oh, I'm going to punt it like the yellow football it is. Just let me find it. And we'll find it and greed. And then I'll need your help, Midnight. We've got to take greed down together. I do not trust my spirit loom with this crack in it. I will make my power unpredictable. That sounds less good. You have a way with understatements, Ascendant. Come, we must hurry through the gate. We must. And this creepy shit is gonna probably molest her. Yes, she will do nicely in the future. The best laid plans are long laid plans. Should anything go wrong, she will suffice. That's probably what I was thinking in his mind. Let's just be real. Right, battle the Chaos Weavers and battle Grease minions. We're gonna do both, so let's battle Chaos Weavers first. Hello. Oh, who? What the fuck are they? Did you see those guys? They looked well creepy. Hello. How are you? You, you two are ugly. I was going to say black, but that sounds quite bad, doesn't it? It's because the skin is literally, well, the the faces are literally black. I was going to say black, but that just sounds really bad. I'm sorry. I'm not racist. I was just, it was descriptive words, okay? Descriptive words, and I almost made it sound really bad. That was a waste of an attack. But that's fine, because wasting attacks is clearly what I love doing. By the sound of it. Wait. Oh, he's twitching. Is he? Yeah, they're like twitching. Oh, they're weird. They're creepy. Damn. Creep. <laughs> N never mind. Oh god, I say some daft shit sometimes. War rewards. Oh yeah, I wanted to buy one of these. Because, um, I wanted like a scythe. Because, um, for those who are not really... Well, for those of you who don't know, uh, scythes are actually weapons that scale with any offensive ability. So, skill with strength, dex, int. I think that's that's it. Straight for de dex int. So I think if um scythes are some of the best weapons to use if you're a very high level, because what you can do is if it works like this, I assume so. Um you can um you can have two hundred in strength, int and dex, and I think it stacks. I don't know, maybe. I wanted to get one of these. Sixty to seventy two. It looks kinda cool, so um you know. Even if it is a key. 60 to 72, what's mine? 58 to 76. Um, they're about as good, because... This one's got a lower attack, but a higher end damage. And this one has a higher, lower, and a lower end. Hmm. I think the M key looks cool, so we'll use this. So we'll look at it. Let's have a look at it. Oh. Uh, well, we're not holding it very much like a staff, are we? Like a scythe. 
I thought it was going to be bigger if I'm honest. <laughs> I'll keep it. Battle Chaos Weavers, uh, we'll battle Greed's minions now. Badoom. Oh wait, did that do less damage? Wait, am I wrong? Am I wrong? I thought side skill with int as well as other stats. Oh, I was wrong, wasn't I? I was wrong. Uh, I think I know why. Because I think my Sydney class does less damage if I'm not using the right weapon type. Oh no, I think it's the same. I think it's fine. Yeah, it's fine. Okay. I thought I was doing less damage. I guess I was doing... What, what, what resistance is? Uh, I guess I was doing good damage. Kind of like the way this key looks anyway. Don't know about you. Yeah, it's definitely good. You look weird, don't you? Looks like a little cock and ball to so like his balls. And then that's his shaft. <laughs> wow. Just me to find the cock and balls in a, a weird tentacle guy. Easy enough. Uh, your choice, attack or defend. Attack embodiments. Oh, it's one of these. Boom. 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 Well, we've got some epic, epic accuracy here. Are you ready for this? Ugh. Whoa. I like how they didn't blow the other guy up, even uh, hit him in the face. There you go. Guess we have a bauble. We'll do story cutscenes. Avarice so nice. Story and 50% stories and 50% cutscenes. I don't know what uh, of this. I don't know what that means. 50%. I guess it's 50% way through the quest. In fact, oh, in fact, Tomics. Well, I guess that it says all I've got to do, judgment. Wait, please view the sorry cutscene. What these? They're fully. A uh, meeting Val. Look at him. Come on, Val. Come on, Val. Da, 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 da. I think we've reached the mid middle of Pella Village, Tommy. Isn't that isn't that the man we saw a statue of in the market district? The entropy looking guy. Uh the one the little child weavers are praying to. And the name on the statue was in the prison. And the statue on Sigda statue. The signature on these schematics in the museum. It's Val. Fail. Click anywhere to continue. I don't know why I've read that out. Who dares disrupt my contemplation? I don't know what that said. I think I got it. Get off. There's a hair on my face and it's pissing me off. Whisper. Let me tell to him. You know how to handle uh, make, make, make megalomaniacs. I've had a lot of practice. I'm addressing Val. The hero is a raven loss. Ah, a supplicant. Have you come to beg for knowledge or ref re refuge from that Haridans? Wait, Har Haridans? But wait, you have, you wait, aren't case weavers. How have you come here? We are seeking information, O oh, wise one. Excellent a evidence of your greatness still exists throughout Ravenloft. Would you, could you answer some questions for us? We would be so grateful. I remember this guy's speech is like a lot. Finally, someone who knows a proper address. Only I could have convinced German wheel, only that I could have directed the priests who have solved threads from it. 
I'm the next to My mother would tell me stories. I don't care about your stories, you ugly green haired fool. No offense to anyone with green hair. I don't have anything against that. I'm just saying, using that as a offense towards him. So the Drupal will be grant wishes so that would also judge them. And if it judged my will. Who cares? At the end of the day, we're coming here. I don't know why we're here actually. I mean, I could read it, but it's not really important. I think we're just coming here to seek guidance or help of this prick. And he's, he's an asshole anyway, so he's not gonna help us. Uh, the only way we could do it here with the Dribble Wheel, we can only use that, so let's deal with the one about to find it. Thank you once more, uh, umpotent ruler of the time and space. We will not trouble you any longer. Hmm, yes, go. You may leave your tribute on the way out. <laughs> this fucking take a shit on his door doorstep. <laughs> and that's my tribute. I saw he's getting off me anyway. He's not getting anything else off me. A creepy shit's back. I think I'll pay a visit to that soul weaver. The one who runs the school. There is much I should discuss with him. My prized possession will be kept busy with this hunt. Yes, very busy. So how to find things when they are not where they should be. Grin. We'll be on judgment wheel, dear. Greed. He's going he's to get in the judgment wheel. No. Oh. <laughs> He's becoming human. It's his human self. Ha! This is my destiny. I wish to wish my pretty red pet with fears of oh, fuck off. Learn to speak, and then I would read your thing. You don't deserve to know the joys of humanity. Not when you aren't really human. Not a human? Then what do you call these fine arms and legs? This is beautiful face. Hmm. This power uh, caressing through my veins. He looks better when he was a, um, a weird spirit guy. No, this will not be. He's in a leap of faith. Oh no, he broke his... His loom thing, whatever you call it. Spirit loom or whatever. He's a fucking idiot, that's why. He's dead. Tomix, midnight, please. Remember me. Eh. He died. Greed. Yes. Grin. Ah. Uh, I'll get you greed. Oh, you're gonna get fucked, mate. I hope you are ready for this level of treatment. Because I honestly don't think you are ready. Wait, did I do that? I No, he's already got a weakness to fire. This is even better for me, Greed. So I'm very sorry to do this to you. But you're about to rest in peace. I hope you're ready. Two more hits, and you are fucked. One more hit, greed. All you've got to do to me is 72 damage. That would have molested him even more. If he had more health. Judgment wheel, it broke. It did. I think, I think it must not have been made for battle. Greed must have not thought of that. And Greed wasn't immortal. Do you think the German wheel... I think it must, may, must be right. It just his wish. I think... I think it not only didn't make him immortal, but possibly weakened him. The wheel had already demonstrated that it showed no mercy. Uh, when the wielder made a wish it disagreed with. I think it's for the best that it is gone. Now there is no grimmance. What's grimmance mean? 
temptation, much as I might have wanted to wish it on myself. His spirit's leaving him. Tom Hicks. Gasp. If I destroy that spirit, the world will finally be rid of the evils greed perpetrate, perpetrated, and I can continue with all my mission to destroy all of the corrupt elemental spirits who have, ah, tainted and twisted my life. Boom. It just got bombed. What? It's your boy Val. It's, it's my soul Eva and my favourite new flunky. I knew you would be here. Everyone wants my prize. I may not be able to use it again, but that does not mean anyone else is permitted to. Not you, not the about 30 guests used for a spirit, not anyone. You thought you could ignore me? That um that I wasn't worthy of battle? You thought you could ignore my brethren. Brethren. I dealt with them on your way here. You are nothing compared to me, to us, and you did not come close to annihilate to my people. And now the greed, greed, now that the gate has been opened, the entire world will fall before my might, for the might of my army. You'll meet again, flunky in the above ground. You're just jealous because you're not in the above ground. I'm in the sky anyway, I've got dragon. Just Judgment Wheel is gone. At least you won't um, have lust than envy hunting that anymore. But it seems both of us have work left to do. Val is waiting for me. And lust than envy are hunting for me. I need to find Asper. I don't know where he's gone and I'm worried. I need to help him get on my hunt. I'm sure he's somewhere nearby. Thomas, you must be careful. You will be careful, won't you? You <laughs> just say, no, I, I cough, I will be careful, and we will see each other again. That is very, she's creepy, that is very good to hear. She's been taken over by Asper. I will go with Midnight, perhaps I must continue my studies in acromancy. At Midnight, we'll need to fully understand the case we was more than ever now. It will be good to spend time in Falconreach. It will be good to have you there, smile. What tell us, Tomix? What do you do now? Lust. Say what now? Lust is here. It's loosed. Oh. It's not finished. No, no, no. Beware, Soul Weaver. There is one in your life who is not who he claims to be. Brace yourself. You already know it's a uh, as what's his name? As asshole. Uh, this is farewell, my good friend. Goodbye. My love, I will keep in touch. Was he talking to me? Well, for now, I must go. I will not fail at my task, and neither can you. My task is to get the Dark Orb. I think I'm on next. We'll meet again someday. The end. Wow, this one's short. I thought this um, would be much longer. Timeline. What have we got left to do? Oh no, we've got a collision course and um Well we don't have to do these, but you know, it's part of the timeline. The whole idea of this playthrough is to complete the timeline. Hence why we did Bacon Origins, the first part of this, hence why we did the Donovan section, hence why we did Seven Limcrest. I thought we have to do that anyway actually. But still, we did it all because it's part of the let's play thing. So yeah. We've got Klizikos, Into the Void, we've got Dark Letter, this little shit. These are like two quests or one quest. Uh, we've done this and then we've got this and then we're done. Really excited to be finished book one. It's not because I'm not enjoying it, because I am. I'm having so much fun playing this. But it's like, it looks be really fun to actually get onto book two. Because believe it or not, I've played book two. I think I got about halfway through in the total of quests. And I never finished it. But, I mean, book two is really short anyway. It's got some big quest lines, but it's got about three or four of them. Anyway, I'm going to lose on it again. Sorry it's a bit short. I know the last one was pretty short as well. I think the last one was like... It's like 15 minutes, 13 minutes, something like that. So I feel kind of bad that this one's short as well. 
considering I'm out of time to record another video as well. I don't know. I feel kind of bad. As I said, though, three tomorrow. So, uh, yeah. That being said, though, thank you for watching this one. I will see you on the next one. Uh, goodbye.